What's up everyone, Dreamcast720 here, back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you some comic pickups that I did, uh, a Walmart pickup that I did, uh, a trade on Facebook, and a purchase on Facebook. So, we're going to jump right in. Uh, the comic book pickups, the first one I picked up was Captain America number 213, which finishes out the Jack Kirby run on... The Captain Americas that I showed you last time. Then we have Conan number 115, which is the 10th anniversary edition. Then we have some Invaders book number 28. Featuring the Kid Commandos. Number 29, which is the Origin of the invaders then we have the fantastic four number 242 which has a terax appearance then we have the hulk number 246 which has a captain marvel appearance and lastly, we have the Avengers, number 230, Yellow Jacket, No More. All very good books. All were very reasonably priced. So I'm not going to complain too much from there. Next, all right, up next is my Facebook purchase. And that comes from Trent's Galactic Emporium. Your one stop in the galaxy for all things Star Wars. And here's the card in the box, along with the website address. And as it says on the back, your one-stop galaxy stop for all your Star Wars needs. So that was that. And what I had ordered was a Star Wars vintage figure that I dated. Came very well packed. As you can see. So let's get that open. And it's the one figure I could not find in my local area for anything. But it's the Mandalorian. Get you a little better shot of that. Get you a close up there. The Mandalorian himself. And the artwork. There's the back with the rest of the figures in the wave. Came packaged very nicely. So if you're looking for anything, like you said, showed you his business card. Kind of check him out. It's very reasonably priced. Very, very happy to have this in my collection. Then, up next was a Walmart run that I had made that I found some figures in there clearance section. I was really surprised. So up first we have, from the Rise of Skywalker, we have Poe Dameron. As you can see, he was on clearance for five bucks. There's the front. There's the rest of the figures in the wave. And the other one was the Skiff Guard Lando Calrissian. He was also Five bucks. Check close up of what he looks like there. Back. And he was in that Mandalorian wave. He was a repack in the Mandalorian wave. And there's that. Um, it was a very good clearance buying time at Walmart. So I got that. And then and the Galaxy of Adventure figures they had for two bucks, two fifty. First one, 
we picked up was Darth Vader. That's the front. There's the back. I picked up Kylo Ren. Can give you a little more of a close up of him there. The front. There's the back. And the last one I picked up was the Jet Trooper. Also 250. Show you a close up kind of what he looks like. Whole thing. And of course the back, which has the picture of him on it. Then the one other thing I picked up that they had that you never see cheap was a Nintendo DS Pokemon White version 2 they had for five bucks. I mean, I know it's an older Pokemon game, but hell, for five bucks, you never see a Pokemon game for five bucks and that was what I picked up in the clearance shopping at Walmart then up next was a Facebook trade wonder how many of you guys out there are, are collecting these but it's the world of Nintendo figures and this is the star power Luigi See if we can get you a little better picture there. Camera cooperate just a little bit. There's the Star Power Luigi. The Mario and Kathy from Mario Odyssey. Mario. This time kicking his foot with Cappy. We have Cat Mario. The old Cat Mario. And lastly, in the small ones, we have the Shy Guy. Then there was that one. And then the one other thing that I traded for was the Mario and Donkey Kong set. A little better picture there. That's the Mario and Donkey Kong set. So I want to thank you, Scott, for that trade. It's awesome. Nice to trade ones I didn't have for some extra ones that I had. And then the last thing that I got which I was totally surprised if you're a fan of old school sci-fi is I picked up one of the Robbie the Robots from Forbidden Planet and I'll give you a good look at him up big graphic in the front talks as you see 
that's the side. And then there's the back. So that's it for my pickups, trades, and buys. Let me know what you guys are collecting. Are you guys collecting any of these Mario figures? Are you guys still doing Star Wars? Let me know if you've been getting any comic books. Comment down below. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for tuning in.